Hi, I'm Mathilde. Uh, I recently received my PhD degree in political science here at Aarhus University. During my time as a PhD, I was a PhD representative in the PhD committee at Aarhus BSS. Most of the time, you may feel that your interests as a PhD student are being taken care of locally at your departments or in your research sections. But sometimes the interests of PhD students are not completely aligned with uh, the interests of tenured staff. And sometimes PhD students uh, across departments, across faculties, actually have some of the same problems and some of the same wishes. And that's why it's important that we work together uh, and that we collaborate and take care of, or and, um, yeah, we'll work for the work conditions of PhD students. And the PhD committees are a place for uh, such work. One example of some of the things that I will always remember that we, well, an example where I think we actually made a difference uh, as PhD representatives uh, was when uh, the new recruitment norms or the draft for the new recruitment norms were uh, made public. Uh, and some of the points were, well, created a lot of dissatisfaction among PhDs. And the PhD representatives in the PhD committee at Aarhus BSS worked together with other uh, PhD representatives and with ALPA and JRA to uh, formulate a hearing statement where we made our, um, well, our point of criticism uh, clear. Um, and we actually succeeded in getting the draft or the norms modified. Um, and I think that was a really, really good, um, well, it was a success. Uh, so that's why I think, uh, I, that's why I hope that you will all be sure to, in the future, maybe consider running for the PhD committees and at least engage in university politics and support your local representatives. Mm -hmm.